The video on the left is what I actually recorded. The video on the right is after enabling eye contact with one single click. The AI magically rotated my eyeballs within their sockets so that I'm looking at the camera in the video rather than whatever my eyes were actually looking at when I record it. And I have no idea what I was looking at in this section of the video where my eyes are completely off to the left. In this comparison, notice the difference that the AI eye contact made in the amount of glare that comes across on my eyeglasses. And here it even appears to have helped out with my wonky eye. Yes, I have a wonky eye where my eyes don't necessarily always work together. 3D movies don't do anything for me because one eye will work and the other one is just taking a nap or whatnot. But it looks like clicking eye contact on this video reformed that issue. Yay. I am quite impressed. When the eye contact feature was announced, I didn't expect it to work very well with folks with eyeglasses, especially with glare on them. And I never imagined that it would help those of us with the wonky eye. If you're not looking into the camera when you record a talking head video, you're not looking at the viewer. We make this error when we're trying to read a script or notes off of the screen, so the camera is recording us looking at something rather than putting us eye to eye with our audience. But most of us don't have the gift of being able to talk directly to the camera without having our message memorized, and who has time for that? Or using a script or at least some notes. We can use a teleprompter, but those contraptions are weird to set up and require a whole other skill set to use. Here's the solution. Eye contact into script. Just import your video, click one button, and the AI software rotates your eyeballs painlessly within their sockets so you're looking at the camera rather than whatever else you were actually looking at when you recorded. This feature is available in Descript, which is an audio, video, podcast editing software. It's one I've been using for quite some time now that has some amazing features in addition to the eye contact. If you don't have Descript yet, I recommend you check it out. There's a link in the description. There is a free plan available and you can stay on free as long as you like. Free doesn't have all the bells and whistles and it has some limitations on how long you can do things. The free plan gives you plenty of room to check it out and see if it's going to work for you. I am an affiliate, so if you end up making a purchase at some point, I may receive a small commission. It won't cost you a penny more. Thanks for watching and have a great day. That's all.